solve this equation, where x, y and z, are integers. From the equation, we can see that, if x and y is a solution of the equation, then negative x, or negative y, or both negative x and negative y, are also solutions of the equation. So without loss of generality, we assume, x and y are greater than zero. Let d is the greatest common divisor of x and y. x equals d times x1. And y equals d times y1. Where x1 and y1, are positive integers. Substitute x and y in the original equation, we have, 13 over d squared times x1 squared, plus 1996, over d squared times y1 squared, equals z over 1997. To remove the fractions, we multiply the equation by 1997, times d squared, times x1 squared, times y1 squared. Then the equation becomes, 13 times 1997, times y1 squared, plus 1996, times 1997, times x1 squared, equals z times d squared, times x1 squared, times y1 squared. Because the greatest common divisor of x1 and y1, is 1. So x1 squared must divide 13 times 1997. And y1 squared must divide 1996, times 1997. Because the greatest common divisor of 13 and 1997 is 1. And both 13 and 1997, are square free. So x1 must equal 1. Because the greatest common divisor of 1,996, and 1,997 is 1. 1,996, equals 2 squared, times 499. And both 499, and 1,997, are square free. So y1 can be 1 or 2. Therefore, x1 y1, equal 1 1, or 1 2. Case 1, x1 y1, equal 1 1. Substitute x1 equals 1, and y1 equals 1, in equation 1, we have zd squared, equals 13 times 1997, plus 1996, times 1997, which is equal to, 1997, times 2009. 2009, equals 7 squared, times 41. So zd squared, equals 1997, times 7 squared, times 41. Because the greatest common divisor of 1997, and 7, is 1. The greatest common divisor of 1997, and 41, is 1. And both 41, and 1997, are square free. So d can be 1 or 7. Then from equation 2, we can work out, z equals 4,011,973, or 81,877. So x, y, z, equal 1, 1, 4,011,973, or 771,877. Case 2, x1, y1, equal 1, 2. Substitute x1 equals 1, and y1 equals 2, in equation 1, we have 4 times zd squared, equals 13, times 1997, times 4, plus 1996, times 1997, which is equal to 1997, times 2048. 2048 equals 2 to the power of 11. Divide the equation by 4, we have zd squared, equals 1997, times 2 to the power of 9. Because the greatest common divisor of 1997 and 2, is 1. And 1997, is square free. 
so D can be 1, or 2, or 4, or 8, or 16. Then from equation 3, we can work out, Z equals 1,022,464, or 255,616, or 63,904, or 15,976, or 3,994. So XYZ, equal 1, 2, 1 million 22,464. Or 2, 4, 255,616. Or 4, 8, 63,904. Or 8, 16, 15,976. Or 16, 32, 3,994. So in summary, for x and y are greater than zero, we have seven sets of solutions. There are also solutions obtained from these, by taking negative x, and or negative y.